This is an 18 FET power stage set up running off of Lebowski's uh, controller chip, which you can see down there. So I have uh, six isolated gate drives feeding three parallel IRFB 4568 150-volt MOSFETs. I'm hoping that this stage will be able to burst to... Uh, around 300 amps phase current. I do not know what the steady state will be. Uh, the heat sinking isn't the greatest. I just have an aluminum spreader plate and then that attaches into this case with just a few small fins on it. Um, for light use it should be okay such as e-bike doing high power bursts probably 15-20 kilowatts uh, for a few seconds. We'll see. I have three different thermal couples hooked up to the MOSFETs. Uh, I have the leg monitored, or the leg being monitored on the MOSFET so I can see how hot the MOSFET leg gets because a lot of times that's the limit. I have the FET case temperature being monitored and then I have the ambient uh, enclosure temp so that I can see the deltas between them all. Right now I have this powering a decent size 14 microhenry parallel winding uh, axial flux motor. So my phase leads are just really small jumper cables for now. With the two windings in parallel, the inductance of this motor is 14 microhenries and 28 if I'm using just a single coil. Right now I'm running the PWM at 21 kilohertz. Everything's working fine. I've tested all the way down to 7 kilohertz. Works fine. Uh, tried even 40 kilohertz. However, my dead time is too long. It exceeds 5% of the pulse width modulation. I'm running uh, right around 900 nanoseconds dead time. Right now I'm powering it off of a 24 volt 20 amp power supply in parallel with a lab supply that can do 3 amps. I've got the cycle analyst hooked up so I can measure my shunt which is in here. It is a non-low resistance being half a milliohm, 0.555 ohms. But it works good enough for testing on the bicycle. Now let's see if I can show you how it runs here on um, 24 volts. So we'll uh, start this up. And there we go. You can see we're in drive mode 3 by the bright green LED. If we shut it off, it'll go back to drive mode 2. And there we go. Here's the current at 24 volts, 4.3 amps, no load. Back off the current a little bit. So yeah, it starts up pretty nice, runs well. I think I'm going to go put this on my bicycle and try it out and see what it's like. See what it's like to ride. <laughs> 